Hello. Hey, Chris, it's Brenda. Hey, what's up? Well, I wanted to let you know, I just got nominated to be president of the Skyline PTA. That's great, but what does the PTA do? What does the PTA do? I have no clue. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know that. Um, I don't know. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. I think it's parent something something. The PTA provides over 30 different services to the school to help the kids have a better education. The PTA raises money for the Wave newspaper. Kid Waves is the school newspaper for Skyline. The kids decide what to report on and they run it. They, they write all the articles. They really like it. Yeah. And so a lot of teachers have started to use it in the classroom where they have to do a scavenger hunt and look for certain articles and uh, even having them write uh, response and thank you notes to the, the kids. Like I really liked your article about you know, the playground because it was cool. My name is Caitlin Davidson and I am a first year teacher at Skyline and I just want to thank the PTA so much for the donation that they gave me. They gave me a gift certificate to creative teaching and being a new teacher things like that are so valuable that I was able to buy books for my classroom and my library, which I'm constantly trying to build. I bought notebooks, pens, glue for eight cents a bottle, reading folders, and contact paper. I bought colored cardstock. I bought really big rings that we need for our alphabet books. Supplies for the kids. I got folders and markers and storage bin. Things to help keep myself organized. Folders for reading, spelling, and other activities we do in the classroom. Name text with class. Support materials for math. 24 different colored Sharpies. <laughs> Things to like borders and um, charts and just a lot of the stuff that you see in here, it really, really helps me to just get the room set up into the shape it needs to be for the kids to be successful. The PTA keeps track of legislation. I make sure that parents are aware that our interests and the interests of our children in public schools are protected and that we're doing all we can to advocate for our kids' interests up in Sacramento. Where'd you get that book? I got this at the book exchange at Skyline and Salona Vista. Oh, the book exchange that we do every year? Exactly. That's free? I love that. It's one of the best events because each year we ask the kids to bring in three of their favorite books that they've read and enjoyed and in exchange they get to pick out three books that they'd like to read. That's fantastic. So each child goes home with a book. They do, and we actually, the PTA, we purchase books that will help with the upper level kids so that they'll get books that they enjoy as well. That's great. And I know the teachers love the book exchange, and we love doing the book exchange. We do because, you know, it provides hundreds of books for our students and our school. At the end of every school year, the Solana Beach PTA donates back any remaining funds to Skyline and Solana Vista Schools through the Gift to Schools program. Last year that gift to Skyline was $10,000 and we used that money to help fund the technology upgrade that took place over the summer. Laptops are in phase two, so that'll be hopefully either this school year or next summer. We get in there and we help the teachers and we um, help each other and we figure out how to make the school a better place for the kids. And we do all of that with just two major fundraisers, the membership drive and the gift wrap sale. Our goal this year is 100% parent participation. We have membership levels ranging from as low as $15 all the way up to $75.